Colors of Clay is an exhibition that really explores the history of ceramic traditions in North America. So what we do is we highlight not only the American Southwest, which is really known for their ceramic traditions, but we also talk about the Great Plains and the American Southeast and Eastern Woodlands. And we talk about the different types and styles of ceramics that were created in North America, as well as the different uses uh, that were implemented using ceramics. So the color comes in first by the type of clay. So it depends on where you're actually harvesting the clay, whether it's in uh, southeastern Oklahoma, whether it's in the eastern woodlands, whether it's in uh, the American Southwest. And then each Hopi Pueblo actually has their own type of clay that they utilize. And that's what defines, in many ways, their specific style. Uh, once you get that clay, it, it then is going to have different attributes which creates different color and that's why you're going to see black and red and and kind of um, I don't know a beige and some other colors that kind of creep into this but then you add slip which is a mineral pigment and so when that's fired it depends on the type of wood you use and in the southwest for like the black on black maria pieces they utilize manure and so by utilizing manure and these different types of wood it's going to smoke the clay differently and then again create a different color. So Colors of Clay is really where it gets boils down to it at its core. It's these different colors uh, of clay that produce these different styles and regional variances and, and uniqueness. The older material, the stuff, let's say, uh, pre-1900s, uh, is really stylized on the exterior. There is a lot of imaging, there's a lot of engravings, there's paintings on the exterior, but it wasn't necessarily done with this really refined technique. And so what you see today is ceramics that are being done for the express purpose of creating art. And that's really something that's changed in the last uh, 50 years, if not even a little bit further.